Hello everyone, this is a quick tutorial video on how I go through Helgen Keep to give myself a couple of levels and two extra perk points before actually starting the storyline. I'll be doing this on legendary difficulty. We're not going to use any cheats or exploits. There you go. I'll well do my best to gear, explain why I do what I do. More. First, we're going to grab all of our gear. We are going to concentrate on sneak and one-handed to get ourselves to level 3 before we exit Helgen Keep. Go ahead and equip the War Axe. We're going to go ahead and drop all of these items. We're not going to need them. Just to show you. We are on legendary difficulty. We are a Breton. Their magic resist racial passive is probably one of the best for taking on dragons in legendary difficulty. I will show you how to uh, max that out as we go through the playthrough. Our sneak is at 15. We're hoping for a target of 20. One handed should be approximately 20 and we will get one point in lock picking and hopefully a point in archery. Choosing Rayloff is the best option to get the best amount of gear as you're going through Helgen Keep to give you a, uh, a little head start on your gold supply. Once the Imperials come in here, you want to stay in this little cubby hole. Slide out just enough to get your eyeball to open up about halfway and then hide back in the corner. We're going to repeat this through the fight. Get two or three levels of sneak out of this. There's one. Okay, we've gotten back to hidden, so we'll do it again, very slowly, very carefully. Okay, we got detected. Okay, the game is going to not let us sneak. We'll go ahead and work on one-handed, just sneak up behind him regular attack. There's one. He's gonna die too quickly. So we'll just increase our one-handed. Okay, go ahead and we'll take the Imperial Armor, the Helmet, you want anything that's going to be a 10 to 1 for uh, value to weight, except the Imperial Armor because it's, it's worth so much. You want to go ahead and take that, take the Iron Dagger. Before we go through that door, we're going to go here back here are. where the Imperials Alpine. came from. Let's see if it opens up. There's some extra gear back here and a little bit of gold. Take the light armor. Take this iron sword. The iron sword seems to level one-handed quicker than the axe. Some gold on this table. Grab it. This chest has some gold and a helmet. It 
change to the sword, drop the axe. Now we'll catch up with Raylov. That's it. Come on. Let's get out of here before the dragon brings the whole tower okay. down on our heads. Check these sacks. If they have salt pile or tomatoes, you want to grab those. We can try to level sneak on this fight, but it's difficult. This fight and the next one are Damn, hard to level sneak. We'll try, see if we can get one or two points. I just need to gather some more potions. Let Rayloff engage him. Okay, he's fighting him. Very slowly. Hide behind the pillar. Try to keep the pillar between you and the Imperials. Before Rayloff kills this guy. No, it's not going to happen. We'll get some more one handed out of it. Here's our first level up. Take the armor, the helmet, the bracers, and the dagger. Take all the daggers. in this room grab the potions the salt pile also grab these ingredients the frost merriam is extremely important the elves here the garlic grab the potions out of the barrel check these sacks again for salt pile or tomatoes Okay, this basket has rock warbler eggs in it. We want those. Grab this potion, the salt pile, and let's Done. go. Let's get moving. We take our level up. I put it into magicka. We're gonna need the magicka later. Don't use your perk point yet. Room. Hear that? Come on. Wait for him to start fighting. Now. Okay, we will take the light armor and the bracers. There's a shield in this room. Go ahead and grab it. Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this cage. Get everything out of the knapsack. Grab the iron dagger. See if you can get it open with some picks. This is the reason we choose Rayloff. One of the reasons we choose Rayloff. The Torturer has light armor. Has the Bracers. Torturer's Hood, which has 14 armor and only weighs 1 pound. But most important is that steel dagger, and you will see why in the next video. That steel dagger is important. Go ahead and unlock 
all of these cages. This will raise our lock picking. Take everything out of here. Try not to break all your lock picks as you do this. This one should give us our level in lock picking. Gate. Grab the coin purse and get everything from the skeleton in this next room. Grab all the bone meal from the skeletons. There's one, two, three. Okay, we're going to try to level up Sneak. One-handed is at 19. Sneak is only at 18. We need at least two more in Sneak. Orders are to wait until General Tullius arrives. I'm not waiting to be killed. Let Rayloff and the others get ahead of you. Just give the generals some time. Go ahead and get into sneak mode. <laughs> Let them start fighting and then slowly come around the corner. Get the eye to open up a little and then back up. There's 19. Very slow. Back up. There we go, 20 sneak. Now, one handed on this guy. There's one handed to 20. Now, go ahead and loot. Take all the arrows, light armor. Helmets, bracers, and a dagger. Go ahead and take the longbows too. I keep watch of this and pick them through here. Talus guide the both of you. Come back and get these guys, get the armor and the dagger. The arrows, light armor, helmet, bracers dagger. You can pick up these miscellaneous arrows if you choose to. We should have plenty after we loot everybody. Okay, you should have ten daggers. Ten iron daggers. So we've looted everybody. Now we're going to drop 
the sword. We don't need it anymore. Equip the bow. Let's see where this goes. As you cross the drawbridge, it'll collapse behind you. Sneak down through this tunnel. Grab the potion, loot the skeleton, grab the coin purse. Head back down into the main passage. Grab the coin purse. If you stay ahead of Rayloff, go into sneak. You may be able to get a sneak or an archery skill up on these little spiders before Rayloff gets here. And the game went weird on me. Once Rayloff enters the room, the spiders will drop. Let them engage him first. And try to get sneak or archery. Got another sneak, that's fine. I hate those dead. Too many eyes, you know. Go ahead and grab the frostbite venom from the spiders. There's five total. Yeah. And there are seven spider eggs you want to get out of these egg sacks. This corpse usually has lock picks or gold. Grab all of these spider eggs. There's three on the other side. This way. Come on, hurry up. Okay, come across the bridge. Turn left. Up here by this skeleton is another dagger and a health potion. Hold up! There's a bear just ahead. See her? I'd rather not. Go ahead and grab that iron helmet. It's worth decent money. And the coin purse. Watch where you step. We need one more skill up to hit level 3. We're extremely close in archery. That will probably be our best bet. Be ready to run because the bear of course is going to attack once you shoot it. There's our archery and our level up. Now run. That's all you've got. And we are done. Grab everything from the bear. And we have finished Helgen Keep. No cheats, no exploits, no hacks. We've got two levels, we've got two perk points. And we are ready to begin our adventure in Skyrim. Wait. Legendary difficulty as a stealth archer. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And we will like see you gone for good this time. in the next one. No way to know if anyone else made Thank it out you. alive. But this place is